dividing polynomials, number one, divide a, a monomial by another monomial, divide the coefficient, and remember how to divide also powers. Remember that to divide powers, just subtract the exponents if you have the same base. In this case, you have 40 divided by negative 5 is negative 8. Then, x to the power of 7 divided by x cubed, just subtract the exponents. 7 minus 3 is 4, so you have x, 4, and in this case, you have understood to have 1 here, so y to the power of 4. For number 2, just divide the... Uh, divide it. The negative 18x cubed divided by 3x squared is negative 6 since we are following. The negative 9x squared divided by 3 is minus 3. For number 3, we have a um, trinomial and a uh, binomial here. It is wise to write the polynomials in descending order or ascending order. And to divide, just divide the first terms of the divide, dividend and the divisor. So x squared divided by x is x. Then multiply this to the binomial here. x times x is x squared. x times 3 is 3x. Then subtract. You have 0. Negative 6 minus 3x is negative 9x. Bring down negative 27. Then divide again the first terms. Negative 9x by x is negative 9. 9 times negative 9 times x is negative 9x. Negative 9 times 3 is negative 27. Then subtract. This is 0. For number 4, you have a polynomial divided by with four terms divided by a binomial. The same thing, just divide the first terms. You have 2x cubed divided by 2x is x squared. Then x squared times 2x is 2x cubed. Then x squared times 3 is 3x squared. Then you subtract. This is 0. 11x squared minus 3x squared is 8x squared. Bring down 2x. Divide the first terms. 8x squared divided by 2x is 4. 4x. 4x times 2x is 8x squared. 4x times 3 is 12x. Then subtract. 8x squared minus 8x squared is 0. 2x minus 12x is negative 10x. Bring down negative 18. Divide the first terms. Negative 10x divided by 2x is negative 5. Negative 5 times 2x is negative 10x. Negative 5 times 3 is negative 15. Then subtract. This is 0. Negative 18 minus negative 15 is negative 3. So we have negative 3 as remainder. So your answer should be written this way. You have x squared plus 4x minus 5 minus... 3 over 2x plus 3. Okay. So for number 5, you have here 3x cubed plus 2x plus 5 divided by x plus 1. Take note that the x squared term is missing. It is best to supply it with 0 as coefficient. So you have 3x cubed plus 0x squared plus 2x plus 5. Divide this by x plus 1. Then divide the first terms. 3x cubed divided by x is 3x squared. You multiply this by x plus 1. So you have 3x squared times x is 3x cubed. Then plus 3x squared. Then subtract. This is 0. 0x zero squared minus 3x squared is negative 3x squared. Bring down to x. Divide the first terms again, negative 3x squared by x, so you have negative 3x. Negative 3x times 3 is negative 3x squared. Negative 3x times 1 is negative 3x.
then subtract you have this is 0 2x minus negative 3 is 5x bring down 5 then divide the first terms 5x divided by x is 5 then multiply 5 times x is 5x then 5 times 1 is 5 5x plus 5 minus 5x plus 5 is 0